You're probably wondering what GAMP TV is. So let me tell y'all, GAMP TV is showcasing everything GAMP, and each week we have new segments that might surprise y'all. Remember to tune in. Introducing GAMP's 2023 talent show. Are you excited to do with your sister? Yeah, I think it's gonna be really fun. We choreographed the dance together, all by ourselves, to one of our favorite songs. So we're really pumped. Thank you. I gave them. It's not easy to know. I'm not anything. It's just a song that I've been working on it for years and stuff, like in classes and stuff. And like I have a really personal connection to it, so I felt like because it's my last talent show and stuff like that, it would be a good way to close out. Thank you so much. I'm doing an interview. Oh. Yeah. Are you nervous? Yes. Um, my throat is like a little bit um, interesting right now. So. <laughs> well, I'm sure you guys will do great. Oh, thank you. Okay, a little, but looking at the audience and smiling faces made me feel a lot more comfortable. Mm -hmm. How did you choose the song you were going to play? Well, it was something I had worked on previously, and I just wanted to show it off. Okay. Thank you. very, very talented, and I don't get to see that every day. But when I peek into their rehearsals, or I peek into the talent show, I can't believe how much talent there is in this school. Is that I, uh, this is the first time that I'm teaching in a performing arts school. So to see the, like, the, the, just the ridiculous talent level of the, of the students is, is, is just amazing. Introducing Senior Spotlight. Hi guys, welcome back to Gap News. I'm here with Abby, and this is our first Senior Spotlight. So basically, Senior Spotlight is when we interview a senior bi-weekly that is very involved in the school, and who is more involved than Miss President over here. <laughs> so Abby, we just have a few questions for you. So okay. what extracurricular activities do you participate in? Well, I'm in student council. I'm the student council president. I'm in acapella club. Um, I, I play softball, and I also manage both basketball teams. Period. Um, what is your favorite high school memory? Uh, my favorite high school memory is prom. Prom? Who has been your favorite teacher and why? My favorite teacher is Mr. Weingarten because I've had him so much and he's also been with me on student council for so long so we just really developed like a close relationship. And what do you plan to do after graduation? After graduation I want to go to college and then I want to go to med school to be either a physician's assistant or a dermatologist. And can we get a fun fact about you? Fun fact, I have a fat cat and her name is Matilda and I love her. Yes, clap for Abby. Hi, I'm Tariq. And my name is Tahari. And this is Kids, kids in, in the, the Halls. Hall. So basically all we do is we wander the halls, interview kids, teachers, and custodians, and we tell them jokes. Hello, darkness, my old who am I here with? Jace. Jace who? Bonner. Alright, thank you. Um, tell me your favorite joke. <laughs> uh what the pencil say to the sharpener? 
What? You look sharp today. Who am I here with? Jared Walker. All right, Jared. So today I'm going to ask you, is it Jordans or Yeezys? Jordans. Why Jordans? They just better. Like, Yeezy just look just ugly. Like, you got Yeezy. Yeah, I'm not going to lie, bro. <laughs> Those look better. All right. Who's one am I here with? This is Miss Taylor. I'm Miss Taylor. So I'm going to be asking you two questions today. First of all, how is the experience again so far? Um, my experience is great so far. I love the students. I really love the environment because it gives me the opportunity to engage every student. And I'm amazed how well I'm being like loved now, which was not the introductory piece I experienced. All right, all right. So now I'm going to tell you a joke. Okay. What did 50 Cent do when he was hungry? I don't know. Bought a snack. Uh -huh. 58. 58. You understood the joke? <laughs> yeah, I got it. All right. Thank Cute. you. Uh, Mr. Baker. So what's your favorite place to eat, Mr. Baker? It's in West Philly. Uh, it's called VNTN. And uh, uh, VNTN is the, is the capital city of uh, Laos, I think. So it's uh, Laotian food. What you like to get? I get the green curry with tofu. Thank you very much. Wait, who am I here with? Jalo. Jalo who? Jalo Ofer. Okay, what's your three favorite songs? I like a song called Can't Hold Us. By who? Um, I forgot their name. But I do. Get up, what it is, like another song. It's called Thunder by Amazing Dragon. Okay. And I don't have no other one. That's it. What do you call a pig that does karate? I don't know what. A pork chop? <laughs> Did you understand it? What? Some I yes, some I no. Can you explain how you kind of understood it? Bro, what are you talking about, man? I understand it now. Can you explain how? Yeah, it's because the pork chop is part of a pig and pork pig chop, pork chops are pork. Right. Most people don't eat pork. Exactly. So it's all about how you see about different people eating right. different stuff. Exactly. Thank you so much. You're welcome. Wait, Eddie. All right. Oh, I got a question for you. What type of music do you listen to when you're studying or like doing schoolwork in general? I uh, listen to some low key rap like Drake. I like listening to some like calming R&B music to calm you down. What type of common R&B? Like Lil Pump, like I'd be like, Cruz Gang, Cruz Gang, Cruz Gang, I'd be doing so good on the test and stuff. Alright, thank you. What did the horse say after it fell? I, I don't know. Help, I can't get <laughs> you up. <laughs> <laughs> this is your host, Tahari. Tark. Remember to tune in next time for Gamp yeah, Kids, Kids in the, the Halls. Tune in to the first episode of Gamp, Gamp TV. TV. Remember to tell us how you liked it down in the comments below. And remember to always stay, stay jolly. jolly. You, you did. <laughs>